when life, when life has become less of an amusement park ride and more a Messerschmitt zero nosedive, when the days become so full and yet so vacant and not even the mirror seems to be your friend, make sure that your scent on descent is more asphodel and accomplishment than patchouli and overdrafts. Make sure all witnesses have been gagged and blindfolded until the moment of impact. Make sure that the public libraries of California agree to close for a week in your memory, and that in lieu of flowers, mourners send Vox teardrop guitars painted in shades of desert dawns to every child on their 13th birthday. Make sure the warmth of your lover, dry, detumescent, resting in your hand at four in the morning is still fresh, and that Gulf Coast acquaintances that you desire friendship and favor of never mistake you for a neck-deprived, college-expelled beer monster named Otto. Make sure your world hasn't deserted you. Make sure your words haven't deserted you. Make sure your layers of midlife malcontent are peeled back far enough for the aesthetic authorities to identify the scars of imagination and homemade tattoos of teenage dreams. Then, and only then, in that final free fall, by any available means, whether by clock set to shortwave noise or the right wing on the left of the dial, a yell from your sleeping partner or your own loud hailing rainbow soul, make for shit sure that for the sake of your biography, you awake before you die.